Hello everyone. Greetings from IEEE SI GST. First of all, a big thank you to all of you for showing up for this session. I hope uh, you guys are eager to know about IEEE Extreme, what it is, how to register for it, on-day process, and everything. Uh, don't worry, we'll be covering it all in this session. So just sit back and no doubt a point you won't. So first of all, let me start over by introducing myself. Myself, Swapnendu Mukherjee, Chief Lead Ambassador of IEEE Extreme 16.0. I'm also working as the current technical mentor in IEEE SI GST. So uh, on my on the screen, you can see my contact details. If you have any issues or queries about IEEE Extreme, you can always reach out to me. So without further delay, let's jump directly into exploring uh, IEEE Extreme 16.2. So a lot of you might be already wondering what exactly is IEEE Extreme, right? The answer lies in front of you. It's a programming composition. But yeah, it's not that programming competition which you have attempted all the all these years, right? It is a bit different. It's a bit more than a programming competition. So let's go ahead. You can see, IEEE Extreme is IEEE's premier programming competition organized by IEEE Global. It brings together thousands of students from around the world together into a 24-hour event. It's a 24-hour programming competition. It is open to all the undergraduate and graduate students. Uh, from uh, from the colleges or universities with an active IEEE student membership. So, what do you need if you want to participate in Extreme? Right, that might be the immediate question. All you need is a system for programming, a good Wi-Fi spell, a bit of programming experience, and you're good to go. And of course, yes, as I mentioned, the most important thing: the IEEE student membership. This competition is exclusively for IEEE members. Which I guess everyone is aware of who are watching this video. If not, don't worry. We'll be sharing the details later on. So the competition is hosted simultaneously around the world. It's either virtual or in a supervised venue. Now let me uh, like note uh, you guys beforehand. This video is exclusively for uh, SIES GST college students. So the venue will be SIES GST, the lab is of SIES GST. So now moving ahead. Computers are required to be doctored by a local IEEE professional member. From our college, it's Professor Bijubal Krishnan sir who is doctoring or mentoring the students registering from SIGSC. So, teams are often supported by local IEEE student branches. You guys don't need to worry. IEEE SIGSC will be there for your service for the whole day. Right? So, remember I said uh, it's a bit more than a programming competition. Now, let's see what makes it unique. IEEE Extreme is one of the largest competitive programming events in the whole world, with over 12,000 participants in 2021. It always aims to be welcoming an international community. We are open to any college student that wishes to join IEEE, you know, go for programming, coding, regardless of their level of expertise. You can be the beginner, intermediate, or an advanced level. Just if you have a locally uh, affiliated university, or uh, you need to be a college student. That's it. Okay. The quality of our competition is curated by hundreds and thousands of IEEE volunteers, me being one of them. We have a chance to compete with students from over 75 countries around the world, which includes like-minded people in coding from reputed universities. Okay. So yeah, this is what happens during the competition day, like how it all starts and how it all ends. So first of all, uh, the first step is the assembly of the candidates. All the candidates should assemble in the lab of SIS GST at 5 a.m. Indian Standard Time. <laughs> yes, one day you have to wake up early and be in college at 5 a.m. Next step, you people have to log into the platform and get ready. At 5, a set of challenges will be present. Every hour, a new set of problems will be added to the original set, just like our list depends in Python. You know what I mean, right? Throughout the day, it's not just sitting in front of your system and coding. We'll have some fun activities, You'll be provided with food, snacks. Be provided with uh, you get ample time to rest as well, and a lot, of, lot more things to be there for you. All right, during the competition day. Now, this is the format of the competition, like uh, how the platform is set up for you. As I mentioned, uh, the duration of the competition will be 24 hours, like a whole day. Supports more than 25 major programming languages. I hope uh, you'll be mostly coding in uh, either Python. C, C++ or Java, unless there are some legends who code in PHP, Ruby, Scala, Haskell, right? You guys are great to do that, right? Okay. One or two questions will be added every two to three hours. There will be no penalty for number of submissions done. Submit n number of times you want. 
there's no penalty for time taken for each problem no time limit just you make sure you finish it in the required time slot okay 30 points will be awarded for each correct answer 70 extra points depending on the task difficulty now this is something again uh, which is different from other programming competitions like the difficulty of the task uh, are based on the point like uh, if you solve an easy task there will be less than number of points assigned to it and the points again go down if uh, from the number of attempts uh, that question has like if many people have attempted the problem it may not have the whole weightage you may not get the whole weightage of the problem so that also decreases these things uh, you need to make sure during the competition again we'll provide more details on day about this don't worry as long as you are able to solve all the problems you can definitely win it okay so you can visit iptxtreme.org/rules to know more about the rules of the competition okay let's move on so this is a quick history of iptxtreme as you can see from 2006 we have an exponential growth of iptxtreme we started off with 44 teams We went on to over 5,500 teams in 2021. So over uh, nearly 13,000 participants in 2021. You can see an exponential growth has has been there for Ice Lake Team. This was the main highlights of Ice Lake Team 15.2. The winners were from Georgia Institute of Tech, to Tel Aviv University, Tehran University of China. These were the top three teams for Ice Lake Team 15.2. This year, you gotta make it, guys. The size JC can win it. You know, at least make it to the top hundred. Of course, I believe in your boss, guys. If you want, let's look at what is the eligibility to participate for ICPL team. So there is no registration fee for uh, all ICPL student members. Actually, it is compulsory to uh, have a student membership for extreme. So there is no registration fee required for that. Uh, it can be the membership can be either at a student or a graduate level. Students can uh, participate. We can join together and form a team. It can be from any discipline, from computer science, IT, electronics, electrical, civil, mechanical, anything. Just that knack of programming is required. And I will not highlight the requirements for the proctors and the ambassadors today because uh, their registrations are already over, and uh, you cannot register for them this year. Next year will be going for it. Uh, this video is just for the students from the Thai school. Okay, let's move on. So this is the team composition and like what the team has to be comprising of. You can see you can have a maximum of three student members or two graduate student members and one student member, or you can have even two student members and one graduate student member. Like uh, for a, and with a with a proctor, of course, you need to have a proctor. Like and minimum of one student member should be there. Uh, one graduate student member can also be there, and you need to have a proctor as I already mentioned. Right? And yeah, this is an important point. Um, A proctor can only serve a maximum of 20 teams. You cannot have more than uh, 20 teams registered under proctor, under a single proctor. So, if you're participating from a size JC, make sure it's the first because we can have a maximum of 20 teams uh, under Professor Vijay Dal's proctor. That's about the competition. One. Okay. This is a very important part of ICPE Extreme, which is uh, how uh, it creates an impact. What are the benefits of ICPE Extreme? Like uh, we can highlight over the doctors, ambassadors, and judges and the participants. We'll not be covering the details of the doctors and ambassadors as I mentioned previously. We'll be very conducting uh, about the. Uh, I'll be mentioning about the participants only. So the benefits include networking with a global programming community of like-minded people. You'll have personal confidence, stimulation to personal coding skills. You can get a feedback of how your skills are strong, what level you belong, the global level, right? What what development do you need? And of course, prestige, bragging rights. You can brag in front of your friends, like depending on your final standing, of course. And from my personal experience, I'll highlight this: like uh, being the one attempting for the placements. I would suggest everyone looking for a place in the big tech giants, like you know, Fang level, like Facebook, Amazon, Apple, Netflix, Google. They have to take part in actually extreme mandatorily, as this would give you a huge boost in competent coding, which is asked in 90% of the interviews, like data structures, algorithms. Everything I'll ask is. In the 90% of the interviews, so make sure you are registering for IT placement because that would give you a huge boost uh, in your interviews and uh, your future, uh, whatever you want to do in your placement as well. So these were all the impacts of IT placement. What it can bring to you? Let's move on. Okay, the most exciting part: the prizes for IT placement. The first place, as you can see, gets to travel and, and accommodation to the choice of your IT placement conference all over the world. With three thousand five hundred dollars per team member, 
and the second place gets the $400 cash reward to each member, the third place gets the $300 cash reward to each member, the fourth to the hundredth place will get a gift bundle and a top holder t-shirt, one to each one, right? A lot of prizes, right? Okay. This is the one, uh, the practice community for actually Extreme. So, if you are confused between too many uh, coding platforms, code posters, lead code, code wars, or code chef, even our very own Arena SIGC, right? All these are great platforms, no doubt. But if you want to practice for Extreme, you've got to practice live Extreme, right? So, you can log on to csacademy.com slash Extreme practice for the practice community. Their platform has the exact format of IEEE Extreme. The uh, whole platform is curated exactly for IEEE Extreme. The problems are from the previous competitions, the UI, the compiler, everything is like on day what you'll be facing for IEEE Extreme. So make sure you check that out. It will be a great tool for assisting your programming skills. This is what the uh, platform looks like. You can see the problem statement along with the inputs, outputs, the constraints and everything is given. Get yourself registered to the CSA platform and used to it. Okay, look into the rules if you want uh, more uh, to know, want to know more about the rules and all. Each submission will be considered as an attempt to solve the challenge. So make sure you compile and run and check all the test cases before submitting the code. So these are the things. Next comes the volunteers. This is a very proud moment for us. So you can see the local branches and volunteers provide a lot of support that the IEEE Extreme community and staff couldn't possibly provide to over 12,000 plus global students, right? So this is all about IEEE SI DSC. So we provide the facility coordination, promotion, support, food, drink and everything to you during the competition day. As you can see the fixed prayer from IEEE Extreme 13.0 which was held in 2019. They serve as a backbone of conducting IEEE Extreme in the college. So don't worry, we got your back. I will say this, you always have your back during the competition day. So these are the moments of IEEE Extreme. Uh, so as you can see, the whole day is not just about sitting in front of a computer. You can sleep as well during the night. You're too tired after a whole day of code, right? So it's not just about sitting down there and coding, guys. Right? And always check out. Okay. So these are the important dates of IEEE Extreme 16.0. The registration will be ending on 12th of October 2022. Make sure you register pass and it will be sharing the registration details, the links to register and everything. Don't worry about that. The competition date is on 22nd October 2022. It will start from 5am ISC as I mentioned. And the result date will be within 4 to 5 weeks after the competition. Okay, It may change also but uh, normally within a month after the competition. So come to the end of the presentation so if you have any queries regarding IEEE Extreme you can always check out their website at IEEEExtreme.org you can check uh, their uh, Facebook handles and Twitter handles as well and uh, personally if you have any queries you want to reach out to us or to IEEE SIGST or you can always contact me Sopmundu or Tarzan Kalam our contact is provided in the description so make sure you check those out and uh, if you have any queries you can always reach out to us Again, don't worry, I will play size if you always got your back. So, thank you guys for attending this uh, session. This, I wish you guys all the best for I will play 16.0. We hope this year we make it to the top team from the world. And just keep coding and remember, just be extreme with us, right? Thank you guys.